Hi, Gemini. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what the week brings you. All right, we got the chariot coming out. Could be that you're dealing with a cancer. If you're not dealing with a cancer person, something about a car, you got more than one car. Um, it's like somebody's trying to take control here, move to a situation, a relationship, a marriage into a better positive direction here. Um, somebody could have been selfish here too. Um, just out to get whatever it is they wanted or they're very selfish in their approach in terms of a marriage or relationship or connection. Um, there's somebody who has a, a side to them that maybe, um, they do whatever they want to do, you know, um, and they show that side a lot. It could be you, it could be another person. Um, again, something about a car, you could be purchasing a new car. Let's see what the advice is for you this week, Gemini. Um, the emperor. So yeah, you could have a husband here, an older gentleman here. Um, very controlling. I don't want to say very controlling, but definitely needs to know what's going on. This is a man who's done a lot for himself. Um, he has a, a really firm foundation. Um, money is abundant. Power, prestige is there also. Respect is what this person values more than anything. Um, sometimes they can come off as cold or uncaring. Um, but that's just the exterior to them, okay? Um, it's something about getting to the heart, the nature of the matter here. Um, this person could be older than you, too. Um, they, they have an immense amount of wisdom, wealth also, that will transcend transcend um, th their generation. And maybe they have generational wealth, okay? Um, and maybe this is why they're trying to steer you in a, in a, certain, a certain way or steer the relationship in a certain way. Um, somebody is unmoving, unwavering, too. The advice here is that maybe either you need to take on this persona or this is who you're dealing with. They're not moving. Um, this is what, this is how they are. This is what they're made of. Um, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. You could be dealing with uh, Aries, uh, Taurus. Let's see. Um, what is the outcome? What's the outcome for Gemini this week? What's the outcome for Gemini this week? What's the outcome for Gemini? Some of you are questioning if you want to be in something so controlling. Um, this person is older than you. They provide you with a lot of wisdom. But at the same time, you feel like um, there's not... You feel kind of trapped, you know. Um, let's see. Outcome. Outcome. Outcome for Gemini. This is who you manifested. I don't know. Outcome for Gemini. All right. Yeah. The world card. You're going to go to the next level in this relationship. You get nothing but major arcana. So the universe is really prompting you to stay with this, stick with this, okay? Something about maturity, maturity level moving forward. Someone wants to take care of you, be the provider to a feminine energy, wants to have a firm foundation, solid foundation with you. But you have to create that. You have to be in a place of uh, allowing it to be created for you, yeah? You could be getting engaged or receive a large sum of money, make a large purchase. You're seeing the um, manifestation of your dreams here with the Ace of Pentacles. Something about going to the next level. Some chapter in your life is closed. Now it's time to kind of level up, get serious, get um, mature about the next phase, the next stage here. The universe is um, handing you a gift here. It's just about you accepting it and growing it. This could be a new connection, a new relationship, a new business. Uh, it could be anything. This is the seed of productivity, okay? It's just about being productive. It's just the seed. So if you have a seed, you have to plant it, fertilize it, cultivate it, water it, maintain it so that it can grow. So this is what you have to do in terms of a relationship, okay? In terms of a business. It looks really good. Take care. Many blessings to you. Get your own personal reading by going to the website level. You can also ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You could uh, donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so by clicking the Buy Me a Coffee link. Thank you, Gemini. Many blessings to you.